Hi friends, let us discuss financial accounting paper. Topics covered in this paper. Number 1. Accounting as an information system. In this video, I am going to discuss accounting as an information system. Remaining topics I will discuss in next video. Second topic, accounting standards. Number 3. Accounting for issue of shares. Number 4. Final accounting for companies. Number 5. Amalgamation. So, in this video, I am going to discuss first topic, accounting as an information system. Before starting that topic, just uh, I want to discuss about the, some basic elements. So, first of all, there is a company. Uh, if somebody wants to start a company, they need an investment, nothing but money. So, if they have money, they will start the company. But uh, company needs a la huge amount of money. So, they will collect money from these parties. First, they will collect money from public, nothing but they are investors. Investors, uh, uh, based upon the information provided by the company and based upon the management, they will invest in this company. They will invest in this company. Next one, banks, nothing but lenders. Banks also give loans to the company. Those are nothing but debt funds. While investors uh, invest the money is nothing but equity. Banks also give money as loans, they are debt funds. Banks also rely on the information provided by the company, nothing but their project, they will invest money. Next one, creditors, they will also give loans to the company. Nothing but uh, it is, uh, they will supply the raw material. They will supply the raw material on debt basis. Next, uh, uh, by collecting all this money, management will conduct the business and they will perform the activities. And after doing the business, uh, they will share the profit to the parties, investors, and they will pay the interest to the bank, and also they will pay the money to the creditors. So here, investors, investors uh, without relying anything or without seeing anything, they will not invest money into the company, and also they want some information regarding company, what are the profit element, and uh, what are the growth of wealth. So management will prepare periodical statements periodical statements which contains the financial information and they will provide the financial information to all the parties they will provide financial information to all the parties next one types of transactions there are two types of transactions first one financial transactions non-financial transactions in financial transactions they are economic elements economic elements means they will affect the financial position of the company so they had an impact on assets and equity. So purchasing of asset, selling of asset, investing and also debtors, creditors, all these things are financial transactions. Next they will reflect in accounts, sales, purchases they will reflect in accounts because they are measured in monetary terms. So they will, affect, they will reflect in accounts. Already told they will measure in monetary terms. These are the features of financial transactions. There are examples. There are some examples to financial transactions. These are some examples to financial transactions, sales, purchases. So all sales and purchases have economic impact and they will change the balance sheet financial position and they are measured in monetary. Next non-financial elements quite opposite. It's a non-economical, non-monetary, and they have not that much that much impact on financial position. So let's see the example. Suppliers list, maintaining of suppliers list, consumer address updation, share prices movement. First one, maintaining of suppliers list. It is very very important. Even though it is non-monetary, even though it is non-financial, it is very important because if if company wants to purchase any asset, they need to know about how, what are the suppliers, uh, what is the what is the amount uh, in the market of that material. Right? They they have to raise the tenders. And based on the tender, they will pick up the supplier and also customer's address to maintain the customer relationship. And also, and also share prices are share prices movement because they have to in at what time they have to sell the shares. This is also this data also maintained by the company to take appropriate decisions of sale of shares. All these are non-monetary and non-financial information, but they are very crucial for decision making. Next one, system. System means a group of elements acting together for common goal. So, 
all the group of elements are acting together for a common goal example human body heart lungs and all these are acting together so human body is one of the system and our computer computer is one of the system cpu and keyboard mouse all they acting for uh, common purpose to provide the information information system information system is nothing but a system which provides the information is called information system so best example is our computer which provides information so even though manual system may also provide the information for example group of people i send group of people to collect some of the data like uh, statistics and also uh, all these things so those are also considered a system accounting information next one accounting information system we discuss a system nothing but group of elements acting for a common goal information system which provides the information is called information system and accounting information system means uh, which provides accounting information is known as accounting information system an example tally sap so these are the systems to provide accounting information so our topic is nothing but accounting information system first in accounting information system either manual or electronic tally is a software electronic let's take the example of tally first we fed up financial transactions financial data in case of sap it it will also maintain non financial transactions also we already discussed about financial transactions and non financial transactions so both the financial and non financial transactions fit into the in accounting information systems and they will prepare a annual reports i will discuss annual reports in later video in detail it's nothing but financial information I already told management issue financial information to these parties sir to make investment decisions what are those parties we already discussed in the first slide so let's see the parties they are nothing but users of this financial information while taking their financial decision it's nothing but to invest the company or not to invest the company those are nothing but investors bankers creditors so this is the cycle so this is what here observe what is the significance of this accounting information system it's a very crucial role next one financial statements financial statements means uh, it's nothing but the part of the financial information uh, the other name for financial information is a technical name technical name financial statements it consists of following items first one balance sheet balance sheet means uh, it's nothing but statement of financial position it consists of assets and liabilities assets of the company and liabilities of the company next one profit and loss statement of profit and loss it's nothing but statement of financial performance it shows the uh, what is the financial performance for the particular period either profit or loss next one cfs cash flow statements it's a statement of movement of funds we will discuss in the later videos it is also in the part of syllabus it's nothing but uh, let's discuss the uh, next one notes to accounts notes to accounts means uh, uh i will uh, what are the terms and conditions used by the company while preparing balance sheet pnl and cash flow statements i think but uh, there are some there are some rules to be followed by the company nothing but accounting standards what are those policies they follow they will discuss they will mention in this notes to account uh, let us discuss the cycle of accounting information system first uh, in source documents source documents means uh, if you go any shop uh, they will give the invoice to you and they will they will maintain one copy of invoice that is nothing but source document which is the proof for the sales uh, based on the source document they will pass the entries in the general book and uh, that is nothing but general all the entries are classified into accounts that is nothing but ledger and ledger ledger all the ledger accounts are summarized uh, into trail balance and uh, they will make some adjustments to the trail balance and they will make some adjustments to the trail balance if there are any rectifications and if there are depreciation calculations all these things after doing adjustments uh, uh, the final version of trail balance is nothing but uh, adjusted trail balance after adjusted trail balance they will pass some closing entries closing entries uh, some of the take uh, i will give example for closing entries nothing but provision for income tax uh, for example you will know the company will not know at the first day regarding tax they will know tax what is the tax amount in the last day nothing but 31st march or after 31st march so uh, provision for tax is a closing entry and all uh, finally we will prepare financial statements we already discussed the financial statements
this way company will prepare financial statements and provide the financial statements to the shareholders and other users of financial statements and they will make investment decisions by using these financial statements and let's see the next topic management information system in detail mis mis means management information system let us discuss about management information system first what is management information system management information system is a uh, different from accounting information system management has to take some day to day decisions and also strategic decisions so they require additional information and uh, that is beyond uh, IAS, I, uh, that is beyond AIS. AIS means uh, accounting information system. We already discussed. Uh, accounting information system provides some information like financial statements. Even though uh, that financial statements are useful to the management, they require some additional information. So they can take, they can plan and control the organization. So what are those additional information? So nothing but budgets. Budgets will not uh, budget may not be produced by the accounting information system, and also some strategic information like uh, need to invest in some of the controls or some of the companies or not, and also production control, uh, the, uh, whether to increase the production or decrease the production. These are all these all information will not may not be provided by the accounting information system. So generally, accounting information system. May not provide the uh, this uh, information. Generally, traditional accounting information system may not provide. But nowadays, there are advanced information systems like SAP or Oracle. They may provide the tally and some other softwares. Uh, nothing but basic softwares. They may not provide uh, this information, which required for management planning and control. So, management information system uh, briefly is nothing but planning and control. For planning and control, they require some information. That information, pro the system which provides that information is nothing but management information system. Sometimes uh, accounting information systems uh, may provide, or sometimes other additional system may provide. So whatever the case may be, which provides that information is known as management information system. And uh, let us discuss about uh, accounting information system for them in related to management information system. Generally, accounting information systems uh, functions are classified into three types. There are the functions. First one, transaction processing system. Uh, it will process day-to-day -day transactions. We already discussed nothing but transaction processing, ledgers, and trail balance, all these things. Financial reporting system. It's nothing but uh, uh, maintaining, uh, preparing financial statements, balance sheet, PNL, and all those things, and issuing to the shareholders for their decision making. All those things. Last one. Management reporting system. It's nothing but uh, management information. Management information. Uh, some accounting information systems may provide management information, so they can take decisions. That is nothing but management reporting system. All accounting information systems may not provide, but some may provide advanced softwares like SAP and Oracle. First one, transaction processing system. I already said that uh, daily business organizations. Next one, uh, financial reporting system, nothing but financial information, financial statements like balance sheet, p &L, and cash flow statements and issued to the users and useful for decision making. And next one, management in reporting system, it is nothing but providing management information is internally, so not issued to the outsiders like investors and also banks, all those, things, but internal circulation for the management decision making. Because it is a special, already told, it is no general thing to issue to the, all the parties, only to the management, that to higher level management. This is about accounting information system functions classified based on this uses.